What is MIDI? Besides it being a really weird word, MIDI is actually when you're about halfway through recording your song and you just really need to take a break because you've been working so hard. So usually people say, hey, I'm gonna take my MIDI now. So, hey guys, I'm gonna take my MIDI now, okay? And if you did your homework, you know that's incorrect. Now, MIDI is actually an acronym which stands for Musical Instrument Digital Interface. I've got a session lined up here with a bunch of software MIDI instruments open already, but what is MIDI? Okay, so now you know the acronym, but what does it mean? Let's do a brief overview of it. MIDI is an industry standard protocol that allows communication with electronic instruments, computers, MIDI controllers, and other similar devices and synchronize them together. MIDI doesn't transmit audio signals, so it, it's not technically like regular instruments. So the way we're going to go about recording it is slightly different. What it actually does is it sends event messages about musical notation to the sequencer. And our sequencer is, of course, GarageBand. So GarageBand takes these messages and makes notes on the timeline. Now we can view these notes here at the bottom. We all know how to access the track editor um, from my previous video, uh, the overview of the interface of GarageBand. We just go down to the track editor button right here and it opens up the little window. Now all of these blocks are individual notes. Now every event message tells us when the note was played on the timeline, such as this note for example, when it was played on the timeline, for how long that note was played for, which is how long the little block is for, and how hard it was played, which is represented with the velocity over here on the left hand side. So if I were to click on this guy, this note is 116 note to value of velocity. If I were to click on this one, you can see this one was played a little bit lighter at 108. So that gives us a, a brief overview of what MIDI and what software instruments really are. And let's go ahead and play this just to listen to the track that I've got set up here with a bunch of software instruments. So that gives you a little, little preview of what we're going to dive into now. So please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. And if you have any requests, please send them to requests at mahalo.com.